Hey guys, it's Charlotte and welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another video. So today is Saturday and we are going to be doing our October side hustle. So last month we got paid from YouTube, eBay, and Macari. I didn't do a lot on eBay or Macari, so thank goodness for our YouTube paycheck. Um, but anyway, so if you like these kind of videos, I would love for you guys to subscribe to my channel join my family. I do these videos once a month and I also do money challenges and stuffing my paychecks also. Um, but yeah, so let's go ahead and count. And this is my, just my side hustle for the one month. I do side hustles part-time. I do have a full-time salary job and this one is the side hustle is something that I enjoy doing. I enjoy making videos. I enjoy selling stuff off of eBay and Macari. So it's just a little extra fun whenever you do get paid. All right, so let's go ahead and count. So we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 100, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, and 69. So we have $169 and I did break it up. I will break this money up in a minute, but I did break it up. So YouTube is $102. Macari is $34. That is how much we made per profit. And then eBay is $33. And I just wanted to thank you guys so much for watching my videos, watching the ads, because that is how I get paid from YouTube, is watching the ads through. Um, so $102. And if you know how YouTube works, you cannot get paid unless you meet the $100 threshold. So it's been a couple of months since we did meet the $100 threshold, but we did last month. Um, so yeah, so thank you guys so much again. So we have $102 and then Macari and eBay are my very lowest ones. Um, I did not sell much. I did not upload much. I'm trying to get rid of old items and it did work. I did get rid of a lot of old items. Um, so I'm super excited about that. And I have no idea why my dogs are going crazy right now, even though Jared knows I am filming and I told him I was filming. So he usually takes care of the dogs. So. If you hear the dogs, I am sorry. <laughs> all right, so let's go ahead and just add all of this together just to make sure it all equals out. So $169 is the total profit. Now, of course, we're taking that $169 and we have to take taxes off. So taxes is going to be $33 this month. So we're going to go ahead and get to stuffing. As you can see, I already broke it down to where all of our money is going to go. And a lot of it is going to be going to long-term vacation, long-term and vacation funds pretty much. So first off, let me just run it down. So taxes is going to be $33, like I mentioned. Giveaways is $4 only because it's so, it's so low because I am at the, this will make me at the 100 threshold. So then I can figure out what I, what I want to do with the $100 as a giveaways to thank you guys for all of your love and support. I have no idea what I'm going to do, but stay tuned for that. And it might just be a surprise giveaway where I just randomly pick a comment and I will send them the money, send them a Amazon gift card, anything like that. Um, savings is going to be $20, which is going to be our rainy day fund challenge. Debt is $20. Vacation is $25. Pets is going to be $16. YouTube slash eBay, and that is going back into my reselling business. It's $20, so it's $10 each. Furniture is $15, and my fertility is $16. So we are going to go ahead and get to stuffing. So the first one that we're going to do is taxes. Nobody wants to do taxes, but you also do not want to pay for taxes. So we are going to be well prepared to make sure that we don't have to pay for taxes. Oh, and it's not in this binder. It's actually in my long-term binder or my important binder. So it is right here. And we are going to do $33. So $20. 30, 1, 2, and 3. $20. And 10. Alright, so let's see how much we have right now. 
So we have 50, which is 100. We have 20, 40, 60, 82. 20, 40, 60, 83. 20, 30, 40, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, and 64. So we have $364, which is great. $364. So we're just going to go ahead and write that out. 364. Next up, we're going to go and do our giveaways. So our giveaways is truly for my supporters on YouTube. Um, I do have supporters on eBay, but technically they're just customers. I think I had like one repeat pretty much of a customer from eBay, but that's about it. But I am truly, truly think that this is for my YouTube family. So one, two, three, and four. So we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100. So $100 giveaway. And let me know in the comments what kind of giveaway do you want? Do you want an Amazon gift card? Do you just want the cash? Do you want an Etsy gift card? Do you want me to just buy a bunch of stuff off of Etsy and then give it away? Um, let me know down below. I would love your input. I am going to try and brainstorm as well. So the next one is going to be savings. Now I'm going to move this out of the way real quick. And we're going to go ahead and color in one of these umbrellas. I usually do this on Tuesday when I do my money challenges. But it seems fitting since we're going to go ahead and stuff it. And we are going to be putting $20 into our long-term binder. And that is going to be rainy day fun. And with the rainy day fun, I do not count this. We wait until it is a surprise and then we will put it in our savings and half of it in our regular savings. Probably most of it in our high yield savings account and then maybe I'm pretty sure this is over $200, maybe $200 in my regular savings account. So we will see about that whenever that time comes around and we are completely done with the rainy day challenge. Now moving on to debt. So debt, let me just update this. So this is going to be $100. This is just, I'm just going to put a question mark. We don't know. Debt where you are going to be putting $20 in debt. And that will have 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 5, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, and 23. So we have $123 in debt, which is still good. It's a little low than I want it to be, um, but we are getting there. I usually do not take it out until I reach $500 and then I make a $500 payment towards that. Next up is going to be vacation. Now, I also do this on Tuesday with my money challenges, but we are going to go ahead and color it in, and then I will just do a summary on Tuesday. So we are going to go to shopping. Shopping is, the goal is $1,000. If you have never seen any of my money challenges and me coloring in this, this I did tell y'all last week that this is not going to be a thousand dollar goal it is just how much we save in a month um, before we go because we have less than a month we are leaving two days after no three days after thanksgiving we're leaving that sunday to go to disney so i do not expect us to save a thousand dollars i do not want to save a thousand dollars for that because that is just going to put me in high stress um, and i don't want to be stressed i'm just going to save as much as i can so each icon is $25 and we are going to be putting $25 in that. And let me get that money. So we have 20, 40, 60, 65. So we have $65. Okay, and then next, Let's just write $65, which is fine. Pets, which this is actually going to go towards Disney as well because we need to 
have a sitter for our dogs and let's see it is the pet boarding and i will make the announcement on tuesday as well so we are not saving 320 dollars anymore we are actually only saving 95 dollars. i got with the sitter that i was going to go with and she broke it down so she's going to be staying the night here at my house for three nights and i trust her she's a friend of mine um she is dating one of my close friends from high school um i trust her and she is only charging me $95. So essentially I am going to be saving $100 for the pet boarding. So it'll be $5 tip. But then also I, since I know her, I am actually going to be doing a little goodie bag for her, a little basket just to tie her over while she is staying at my house. So like her favorite candy, her um, for treats, anything like that. So that is the plan. So we did... How much did we do? We did 15, 15, 16, 16 dollars. So we have 20, 40, uh, 20, 40, 50, 55, and 56. So we have 56 dollars. And we're going to go ahead and color into 56 dollars. Perfect. And I am not stressed about finishing this before we get done because I can always pull from my um, sinking funds, my regular sinking funds that I do have for the pets. So I'm not worried about that. Because let me see, where's my sinking fund for the pets? So if I have $56, technically I have 56, 57, 58, um, 68. Let me just, 58 plus 20, 30. Uh, 25, 20, 30, 35, and 36. So technically I only have to save four more dollars um, and then I will be totally fine with boarding, but I'm trying not to use this because I do need to buy some food, some treats and everything before we leave as well. Uh, well, actually it's 56, I messed up, but you, you understand you guys. All right, so the next one, we're going to go to our YouTube binder again. No, no, our YouTube, but this yellow binder. And we're going to do YouTube and eBay. So YouTube is going to be getting $10. And it's just something that I put back into YouTube. So if I have to buy, like, more clear stuff, if I have to buy more binders, anything like that to make my videos look semi-decent. <laughs> So we have 5, 10, 11, 12, and 13. So we have $13 in YouTube. eBay is also getting $10. So we have 5, 10, 11, 12, and 13 as well for the eBay shop. So we are going to go ahead and do 13 slash 13. And then next, two of my biggest ones that I'm actually working on right now. So the next one is going to be furniture. And the furniture is going to be getting $15, 5, 10, 15. Now we are, I think I'm going to have to buy a dining room table because it's so old, you guys. And we are hosting thanksgiving again this year and i it's on its last limb so here's my plan let me count this and then i will tell you like a little bit of the plan that we have so 100 20 40 60 70 75 76 77 78 79 80 81 82 83 84 and 85 so we have 185 dollars now i have two options i can go to my brother's um furniture store that he is the owner and I could get his like manager discount and everything and it will be super cheap probably if I get a $700 table it'll probably be roughly around maybe $400 or I can go to like a second hand like it's called a restore store and it's a second hand I think people drop stuff off or people not using it or um different companies that are not using it anymore and they drop that and they drop it down to, to super super cheap like i've just found a sectional that was super nice for only 400 dollars, and it was it's so nice you guys um but those are from pictures i've never been so i have no idea 
what they look like. So those are my two options, but we need to figure that out ASAP. So I already forgot how much they have in here. So I'm going to recount it. So 100, 20, 40, 60, 70, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85. So 185. 185. And I will put more money in here because we did complete a challenge. So I'm probably going to be $200 on this one. And then I will talk to my brother and see what we can do what kind of deals he has anything like that so next up is fertility which is our last one and this is one of our important ones because we are on our fertility journey as of right now if you have been watching my pcos journey i am down i think this morning it was 13.5 pounds which is really good it's a little bit slower than this first month but we are thriving i just bought a bike um it's gonna be fun i'm gonna be bicycling a lot <laughs> so 5 10 15 and 16 so i'm super excited about that it'll be great exercise for me but yeah all right let me make sure okay so what we have for fertility 20 40 60 80 1 20 40 45 50 55 56 57 58 59 60 61 62 63 64 65, 66, 67, and 68. So we have $168 in fertility, which is great. I'm excited about that. $168. We do have a, a long way to go if we want to save as much money as possible with that without going into debt. <laughs> but anyways, thank you guys so much. So that is it. We have stuffed so many sinking funds, which is really good for us. We stuffed our short term and our long term. Super excited about that. Um, like I said, it was $169 that was stretched into multiple cash envelopes and I am just so thankful. Thank you guys so much for all of your love and support, for listening to me, watching these channels, watching my ads. Um, it really does add up. And if you have ever bought anything from Mercari or eBay um, on here, and I just wanted to thank you guys so much. But anyways, I love you guys and thank you guys so much for all of your love and support. And I will see you guys soon. Bye guys.